So I'm just gonna keep talking and you're just gonna not gonna cut. All right. We're here on the outskirts of the city beautiful Orlando, Florida for the annual Scottish Highland Games Festival. It should be a good time. Nights, frights, and goats await and I am just ecstatic and ready to go. Welcome to Scotland. Let's go. That's fine enough. Now, I've actually only met one Scottish person in my life. He didn't even say a word to me. He just grabbed my father by the shoulders and kicked his crutches out from under his legs. What kind of axe would you recommend here? A broadly bladed axe like this. A little badish. Can be used to hook armor, hook shields. It also cleaves. It's good for the kill shot. Exactly. Do you have one of these at home? I do. I train with them as well. Really? Okay. Do you have any enemies? I had. Well, this guy's the real deal, so that's the news we're bringing to you. Thank you, sir. What's your name? Gray. Thank you. You know, there are many bands here today. Screaming Orphans, Blood Witch on the River Kwai, Elf J-O-I, that's another one. Double Penetration is here. Calvin Harris is here. I think everyone's going to be here for that one. So what are you guys doing out here? You having fun? Yeah, we're just, you know, hanging out. You guys figure out what clan you guys are a part of? Yeah, uh, Campbell. Oh, I'm from uh, Jelking. Okay. Joking. You guys know the Joking clan? No, I haven't. You should look it up. What are you guys' names? I'm Tyler. And I'm Luca. You went to Overwatch? Uh, we used to play Overwatch actually a little bit. It's been a minute since we played, but yeah, we've played Overwatch. If you had to pick one to have sex with, who would it be? Oh gosh, um, Tracer or Sigma? Mercy? I'm gonna just go with Mercy straight up. Brigitte is a close second though. That's a power, that's a power play. Yeah, yeah. Roadhog. You're, you like Roadhog? Yeah. Or Winston. Oh, Winston. I really like Winston, yeah. For sure. The one, the robot? The, the, I forgot the name of that like one. Like the hamster and the robot? No, not, not no, the hamster, not the hamster, the oh, other one. Um, Diva. 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 Diva, okay, yeah, 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 okay. What was the first one yeah. you said? Mercy? I don't know shit about Overwatch yeah. characters, but that's a pretty hot name. So <laughs> I, I give it that, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. No Winston? No Winston. No, no Winston. Maybe. Not, not even close, right? No. Maybe Winston, maybe. maybe. It's maybe. a maybe. We're walking, I, pa I passed the dwarf man here earlier. I passed like a small like creature with like weird uh, pointy ears. Mugged me for everything I have. I was gonna get, I was gonna get fish and chips. I was gonna get fish and chips. He took everything I had and I can't even find him. I think he like vanished. It was like an imp. So what's your name? Uh, Joseph. Are you kind of afraid of uh, the path that the United States is going to be taking in five years? No, I didn't hear about that, no. Do you ever just kind of fall asleep and just like, you just kind of lay there worried about what the country is going to look like in five years? I think so, yeah. When Mark Zuckerberg sends us all to the metaverse, are you going to give yourself a vagina? <laughs> no, I don't know, man. It's a no question for no, me. No question. Okay. All right, thank you, sir. Okay. So let me ask you about your shirt. The problem with society is nobody drinks from the skulls of their their enemies. I can absolutely agree with that. I think uh, the loss of bloodshed as a method of problem solving has really set us backward in society. Oh yeah. And and your enemy skulls are trophies. No one has rivals anymore. They do. They do. And in, in, in college football, they especially have rivalries. Yeah. They're just kind of ninnies about it. I think. <laughs> yeah. So this is the famous sport known as the Boulder Boogie. This is uh, from Scott origin. Basically, you just kind of carry a big stone uh, from point A to point B and uh, you just got to not drop it. Kind of reminds me of a sport I used to play at home where I tried to fit as many stones into my asshole as, uh, as I could. Lucis Hole wins. <laughs> Beautiful animals, aren't they? Yeah, they're, they're really cool. What's your name, sir? Justin, Justin. Justin, great name. What have you been sipping on? Some of the Dunedin brew over there. It's pretty good. How many glasses? That's probably like my third or fourth. <laughs> we're still going strong? Yeah, we're still, we're still going strong, yeah, yeah, yeah. God bless. What do you guys think about how easy it is for someone to leak your address and dox you and get you swatted and kill you on the internet? I mean, I do it to people all the time, so. For sure. What do you think the balance should be between the federal and state powers? Federal should probably have a little more power than state, yeah. but state should still be able to exact their uh, oh, opinions. Sure. I love the bow you got there. Mm -hmm. The sword he's got there, you guys look equipped for combat. You guys look ready to kill. You like the sword? Yeah. So what's your name? Oh, Ryan. Ryan. Oh, Ryan. Oh, Ryan. Yeah. And you, sir? Atticus. You guys play Fortnite? Uh, no. No. You guys play Overwatch? You know, we live in a, a, a kind of swing state, Florida. It's it, it, it's a very diverse state. There's there's just like a ton of a uh, ton of ethnic groups out here, a ton of nationalities, because this is kind of a hot plate for, uh, for immigration. But uh, I've never seen such a concentration of white people in one place. I've driven through Trump rallies and this is the most single tone event I've ever been to. I'm, I'm, not, I'm not racist and I don't think any of these, I, I'm, not call, I'm not calling anyone racist, but if I was racist, I would, I would have a lot of fun here is what I'm saying. Can we interview the unicorn? Yeah, of course. Thank you. What's her name? Lily. 
Lily, Lily, can I just ask you, do you think the constant bickering between the executive and the legislative branches in the federal government is kind of leading the U.S. into this kind of uh, twisted pseudo anti-democracy? I very much agree.